Showtime. Uh, Roma Downey coming out in moments, then Patton Oswalt from King of Queens in the comedy Very Funny Nick Swartz, and later this week, Ashanti, Anthony Mackie from the new Spike Lee film, and then Carmen Electra later this week, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> First guest is a uh, lovely actress who played an angel for nearly a decade on the hit Touched by an Angel. She's here tonight to update us on her travels around the world as part of the charitable organization Operation Smile. Please welcome back to the show, Roma Downey. <laughs> For me. Just you, that's the way you like it. Yeah. I love the dress. You always come with new outfits, and I assume they're for our little program. You don't Just wear, for you. Right? You don't wear them out anywhere else. Never been seen. Never been seen. No. Yes. Uh, how, is, how is Malibu? Malibu is delicious. Yeah. Delicious. The weather is fantastic. Is it better than in Hollywood? Because it gets a little hot here. It's kind of cool there all, all the time, right? Oh, it's just great. And yeah. the dolphins come by each day and give you us know, a grand show. You know what they're really saying, don't you? Oh, those are the whales. <laughs> uh, uh, so you're not, you're from, you're from Ireland. Yes, it's far from Malibu. I yeah. was raised. Yeah. And you're getting used to it. How, how many years in Malibu now? Just, just a year full time. Oh, That's, wow. In fact, I just had my first year anniversary. Party? A wee bit of a party. A yeah. wee bit, yeah. And my um, my sisters came out from Ireland. Yeah. And they had not been to Malibu oh, before. They well, hadn't this, seen the house before. This is so, great. So they were just thrilled. What did they think when they stepped on the beach and looked at the you know the ocean? Did they think this is exciting? Oh my God! They were just delighted. They were yeah. screaming and hollering. We grew up, you know, in the northwest of Ireland, on the shores of the Atlantic. I'm going to say it's colder there. It's a lot colder. Yeah. See, see. <laughs> yeah. It's a lot colder and windier and yeah. grayer, and yeah. it rains a lot. Yeah. So um, they were just delighted. So to be over they've here. moved in, is what I'm hearing. Is that, <laughs> is that what it is? No, I finally shipped them off, got yeah. them back home. Now, what do you do? What do you do in Malibu for fun? What do I do for fun? Yeah. I mean, do you actually do any water sports now or not? Well, it's funny you should mention that. Oh, really? Because I just took up scuba diving. Oh, really? Yeah. yeah. Is it? Where do you do that? Well, I, no, I didn't. I didn't actually. I learned in Malibu. I had the. I had this guy come to my house. Yeah. I was given a wonderful gift as a birthday present. Yeah. yeah. From a friend of mine, and and the gift was lessons and gear, scuba okay. diving gear. Yeah. And do you do it in the pool in the back first? Is well, that what you that's do? That's what he came to my house. I have a very small pool. Yeah. That maybe at its deepest is, I don't know, ten feet. Yeah. Maybe. yeah. So he just got me used to the. Um, yeah to breathing underwater yeah. and then we went up to the big pool at Pepperdine yeah. at the university. Just the two of you? Just the two of us. Yeah. This is the scuba instructor? Yeah, Grant was his name. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay. He was very nice. And, um, and I was really, really scared. Have you ever done it? No, I, I wouldn't do it now. You I'm know that first moment of, of relying on this, um, yeah. you know, exterior I would supply. choke, I would panic, claustrophobic. Yeah, I, I, I I'm, out, I'm, out, I'm out of the water. You know, I take the thing off. Yeah, I did you have that to be really, you have, to, you have to be really you have at to peace. You have to get very zen. Yeah, you have to smoke pot yeah, before yeah. you do it. And then... <laughs> Very dangerous. Very dangerous. So you're relaxed and you, you're able to do it under in, in the pool? Oh, well, I mean, I was able to do it. One of the things that you have to do to get certified is that you have to take the mask off under the water. Yeah. And I didn't like that part at all. What happened? Well, um, you know, even though you're breathing with your mouth only, the idea that water actually goes up your nose, yeah. it's not good. No, we don't need that. <laughs> you're too pretty for that. So, I mean, I finally did it. Yeah. I did it, and I did get certified. I yeah. went down to the South Seas. Oh, I wow. went to the island of Vanuatu. Ah, and, yeah, well, I think we've um, all heard of that. <laughs> it's way down there. Yeah. And, um, and I got certified down there, and I took, uh, took now, the mask off. What do you mean when you get certified? That means you're, you're able to do this? There's certain skills that they oh, okay. teach you, and you have to do s a certain amount of dives in order yeah. to get your, you know, your badge. Yeah. And the joy. Now, let me, I, I, I've heard about scuba diving for years. You go to Hawaii. They say you want to go a little scuba in the shallow water. It's all to see the plant life and the, and the, and the, yeah, the fish down and there. Yeah, the fish. And it. it's, there's a yeah. wonderful serenity that comes with it, and it's really gorgeous. And at one point, we were able to dive down to a wreck and explore the wreck. Yeah. The what? A wreck. Okay. Um, w R E C K. Do, say it again. A wreck. W. Like a sunken boat. Oh, the wreck. The wreck. 
Suddenly I thought we were in Iraq. I didn't, I didn't, I didn't. I didn't. No, no, no. So no, charming. No, no, no. The little, is that your no. lilt again? Is that's that, just yeah. my, that's my broke. Your broke, yeah. My broke. Um, so, and I saw a moray eel. Mm -hmm. And the first fish that I saw was a clown fish. So I was able to tell my eight-year-old daughter that I actually found Nemo. Oh, wow. So that was cute. Oh, yeah. And, um, and, and the only bad thing that happened was yeah. um, on, on my, on, when we were diving the wreck, yeah. um, I got a condition that's called mask squeeze. Oh. It's, it's kind of like, um, like suck face of the mask, <laughs> like right into, no. it goes right into your head, yeah. and it, it kind of feels like it's going to burst out through the back of your skull, you know. So that's that's painful. That was bad. Yeah. That was bad. There's a picture of you. This is you. What? Oh yeah, there I am. Yeah. In my gear. Yeah. yeah. Another picture. Aroma. Yep. That's you. We have a third picture we can't show, but she's <laughs> stripping down completely. No. Um, but you know, when you when you when you grow up, a, a girl with concerned parents, you grow up usually with the voice a voice in your head that says, "Don't do that. You'll get hurt. Don't yeah. do that. Be afraid." And then when you become a woman, yeah. you tend to have still have that voice if you're not terribly sporty, which I wasn't. Yeah. So this was a big deal for me. It is. I would move, never. Move I would not do this. Comfort zone. I, I would sit. I, empowered. Yeah. Guys, I right? have HD. I'd watch the Discovery Channel and see the fish and see the <laughs> all that. Right. That's what I would do and see the wreck or the Iraq and it would be, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> I didn't know you were a thrill seeker. Has your new boyfriend influenced you? Somewhat? Uh, he has influenced me, you know. This is not Grant. This is not the this is uh, not scuba Grant. instructor. No, no, no. I, I have girlfriends who have boyfriends who play golf or, or who like football and, and in the spirit of compromise they've taken up golf or they've... Yeah. You know, watched they've football. watched football. Watch football. And, and there were moments when I was, you know, diving to 120 feet that I thought, oh, God, why couldn't it have been somebody that played golf? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, tell them who it is and see if they know who it is. Um, his name. <laughs> All right. It, <laughs> we're embarrassed. It must be, a, it must be, it must yeah. be very new. It must be well, very. It's, it's, you know, but. You yeah. Know. Mark Burnett, the, Mark Burnett, the producer of Survivor. He produces Survivor. <laughs> There's a nice boat on the other Stay with us. Five questions when we get back and run down. All right, be honest. Which correspondent on 60 Minutes would you least like to be touched by? <laughs> Mike Wallace, Morley Safer, or Andy Rooney? The answer when we return. And now the conclusion to Roma Downey's Classic Five. Which correspondent on 60 Minutes would you least like to be touched by? <laughs> Mike Wallace, Morley Safer, or Andy Rooney? Um, Andy Rooney. <laughs> wait, wait. Actually, no, surprisingly, it's Morley Safer. <laughs> Roma Downey, so it's called Operation Smile, and this is uh, this is you. Oh, it's a fantastic organization. You know, you're in the business of making people smile, yeah. but these doctors are all volunteers, and they go all over the world, and they help children with facial deformities, right. primarily cleft lip, cleft palate. And I went on a mission with them to Vietnam, yeah. and had the privilege of participating in the. Um, reparation of 125 children. Wow. And how, and how, how often... Uh, <laughs> You've been doing this for a while? Or? Yeah, I, I, um, I joined their board of governors about a year ago. Yeah. I first uh, got introduced to the group when we did an episode of Touched by an Angel, loosely uh, based a, a story around them. And they're just I was so moved by what they do. And, yeah. you know, for just a couple of hundred dollars, you can change a child's life yeah. forever. It's yeah. really That's great. wonderful work. Yeah. I, 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 um, <laughs> I, I, hate to get, I hate to get competitive, but it's now time for five questions, which you dread, ladies and gentlemen. Five questions. <laughs> geography. Geography. Uh, true or false, there's a Downey, California. True or false? True. That is correct, ladies and gentlemen, right there. <laughs> it is the old match game. The old match game. Fighting blank. Fighting blank. Fighting fit. Fighting fit. <laughs> this is a uh, school. Fighting it's, Irish. It's a bit, yeah, we'll get that. Yeah. Although, 
I think Fit was second, right? Fit, fighting Fit. <laughs> <laughs> Ten seconds on the clock. Besides an angel, name three things it's okay to be touched by. Uh, Ready, ready go. Uh, the smile of a child. Um, beautiful sunset. Yeah. Um, love. Okay, that's correct. Yes, very good. Love. Oh. Is it true? Now, you're talking about your sister's visiting in Malibu. Your brother is a priest, right? Yes, yes. Confess something in my ear that I cannot tell the audience. <laughs> they cannot hear this. Oh, my Lord. I, did they... Huh? Wow. They have something... That was not much of a whisper. My uh, my brother's a priest, and we call him Father Brother. Ah, oh, that's funny. <laughs> See? That's funny. Okay, wait a second. Oh, uh, three chances. I'm going to give you a little cash here for you. $100. $100. Uh -huh. If, to your charity, if you can hit Michael yeah. Bryan over there. See him over there? Where is he? He's over there. Yes. You have to hit him with a water balloon. You have three chances. Okay? Move in a little bit, Mike. Oh, that was close. Don't move. Hey, hey, he moved. There it is. You get that money? Thank you. Very good. It's called uh, Operation Smile. It's helping kids around the world. Her name is Roma Downey. Nice to see you again, young lady. Thank you so much.